Copilot is the newest product on the block for Formstack. At this time, only a limited number of customers have access to this tool. If you don't have access, don't worry, we have a form you can use to request access. As we move to more and more hybrid and remote workplaces, modernizing the process around the early days for our employee experience is key. With Copilot, you can build employee onboarding workflows in minutes that keep the right people in the right loop. With Copilot, you're able to build powerful workflows with data collection, document generation, and e-signature. And we can use all of those pieces for our employee onboarding. To get things started with our employee onboarding workflow, I'll show you my final flow in Copilot. First, we have the form step. With all Copilot workflows, you have to start with a form step. As a business leader, the ability to collect data, store it, and act on it is incredibly important. Next, I actually have another form step. Yes, what I'm using is form to form prefill. This is something new for Formstack. Here, this step collects data that I want different people in our organization to have access to from the previous form. So within this step, you can see that I've mapped over some fields. I also have the ability to actually assign this step, fun fact. I won't do that here, but my next step after the two forms is to generate a document in the background. I actually have no fields in my document where I want to use the data from my previous forms, so that's why this portion is blank. But the final step in the workflow for employees to execute is the signature of my employee handbook. You can see I'm able to drag and drop data from my form to identify who should sign. Next. Let's talk about my actual form that I use so you can see some of the nuts and bolts of my workflow. My first form, that employee roles um, and work styles doc form, this data I actually want to go to the manager for the new employee. Here I'm able to use things like conditional logic, make sure I'm using um, styling that matches my org. I can even use field prefill if that's what I want. My next form, this data I want to be passed to my people ops team because it's employee handbook review, I've hidden the details of the employees where I'm using form to form prefill, which is set up within Copilot. My final asset of this workflow is the document. Here I'm within form stack documents. I have an employee handbook acknowledgement where I've added signature tags. You can see I've highlighted it. All I'm using is the new builder. So if you wanted to do this yourself, you'll do insert e-signature tag, click insert tag, Make sure it's formatted the way you want, and then make sure that text is white so it doesn't show up in the final document. So you can see that's there. This data actually informs Copilot that I want a signer to sign right there in the document that is customized. So I'll actually build a workflow starting from square one so you all can see how I make this whole thing work using the assets I just showed you. First, I'll start with that first form step. I'll click configure. I'll search for my employee onboarding roles and work styles form. I'll click in, then I'll add my next form, which is the employee handbook review. This is where things get really cool with form to form workflows, um, or excuse me, form to form prefill, and also form stack copilot, tying things together. You'll see I'm drag and dropping data from my previous form into this next form so that information is seamlessly added. My next step is a document step. This actually generates in the background and no action is required. Here I'll search for my handbook document. Take just a minute because I may or may not have forgotten how to spell handbook, but we'll make sure I find it and I'm able to select the right document here. And as I said previously, I don't have any fields with merge tags on my document that I want filled with form data. All that I want is a sign step. So you can see here that Copilot identified that I actually want a sign step added in that document. So from here, I'm able to customize that sign step. I'll click in and I will use data from my first form to identify and inform and route my signature email for the employee handbook acknowledgement to my new employee. I can name this document whoever I want. I can CC it to whoever I want, maybe people operations. I can also customize the configure message and boom, there you have it. My workflow is here. I'll simply open in a new tab. I'll take a test on this first form. And after this form, what you don't see is in the background, um, well, you'll see a notification for me to fill out the second form, but after that second form, it eyes the employee. In the background, documents will customize the document for me and then send to this employee to sign the employee handbook acknowledgement. I won't show all of those elements, but you can see how simple it was to build this workflow in Copilot.